name is Carlos Martinez. I am from Seattle, Washington, and I am a painter. And this is my work. Well, I started painting when I was uh, 19. I really fell in love with it really quickly. And I had always been a very creative kid. I always wanted to have a life where I was free to be creative, but I didn't necessarily know what that would look like. And just painting felt really natural to me. I wasn't really that good at it, um, but I had a lot of fun. And so that was a kind of like a natural path for me to take on. And for me, um, a really big inspiration, especially um, thinking back to little of me, was um, still is representing people who look like me into fine art. And whenever I did have a chance to go to an art museum or an art gallery or see fine art, I didn't really see myself represented or even reflected in the majority of the work. And so I thought, well, I can do that. Why not just put myself onto canvas? And so um, that really was the beginning of like me figuring out the perspective and my voice as an artist too. And uh, visually my work has progressed into more of a surrealist um, style. Um, and this is one of my earlier works that I made, I believe it was like in 2018. Uh, it's called Brown Boy. It's um, acrylic on canvas and it's 36 square inches. It's one of my bigger pieces. And really the inspiration behind this was um, uh, my little brothers. They're really beautiful brown little boys. Um, they have really big eyes, especially my little brother Santiago. And I have always been really fascinated with eyes. A lot of my earlier work has uh, portraits with big eyes in them. They're so expressive and um, just wanted to really highlight like really beautiful brown features, like dark brown skin, curly hair, wide noses, brown eyes. And so this is um, a piece that I created back then. And I really wanted to have the imagery look as if like this child was looking into like the viewer's eyes with its big eyes. And you don't necessarily know if he is hiding or peeking through or is about to jump out at you. And yeah, it's one of the pieces that I'm the most proud of and it hangs in my living room. And if ever it was to be sold, it would be really sad, but you know, bittersweet. And yeah, that's my, the majority of, you know, my inspiration, it comes from representing black and brown boys, people, um, making sure that we have a space in the art world and making sure that folks see themselves represented in art and hopefully I can humbly contribute to that even a little bit.